shot my lash. It was a short makeup use week, but that is okay. Sometimes you just gotta enjoy them days off, and I don't know why it is, but sometimes I just don't feel like makeup being when I don't have to go to work and stuff. Weird. Also, I'm lazy, so there's that. <laughs> Uh, so we started off the week using, well, I don't remember in order when I used these palettes, but we did use the Morph Pony Constellation. I think that's probably my favorite shimmer in there. Good palette. But also, I never really have anything bad to say about Morph palettes. I just like them. We have the So Jaded from ColourPop and Kathleen Lights collab. Like this. We have the Trez Loose I Am palette. This was great. It's probably one of my favorite ones to use this week. And we got the Lippies. I ended up using um, Queen Supreme with the Morph palette. I'm in between. I like this lipstick, but then I also don't like this lipstick. I don't know why. It's a love-hate relationship. We have Dragon Girl here from NARS Velvet, Velvet Lip Matte uh, Lip Pencil. But I was a doozy to get out. Um, I really didn't like this. This is kind of like a softer red for me. So it's just a nice lip pencil. I'll put it back in there. I want to get more of their NARS lip pencils because this was really nice. And then the other lipstick we used was the Joa lipstick in the shade Jet Setter. This is a really comfortable matte lipstick. Good longevity. So for face products, we end up using the Anastasia Beverly Hills Translucent Center Bell. We'll put this back up. Always a go-to. This is, there's so much product in this. But you can use that for a couple months straight and probably still have product left. We have the Jouer, Jouer. I always say it wrong. With the Jouer, this is a illuminating finishing powder here. I will keep this out to keep using because I really didn't like this. We have the Huda Beauty Cream Bronzer here. I actually got a little bit of a dip in this already. Even though I did my makeup like three days this week. I go, I go pretty hard on bronzers and blushes. I just go pretty hard on makeup in general. Besides my, besides my eyeshadow palettes. They seem not to go very hard on. <laughs> Pretty soft on those. We have the Glistening Highlight Palette from You Can Be. A beautiful favorite. I see myself eventually hitting pan on that. We have our Morph C Zero Concealer. Keeping that. I've almost used this up. We have the Anastasia Beverly Hills Mascara. I'll put this one up. I'm gonna keep out the Maybelline Total Temptations Brow Pencil. Keep out our Opening Act Tarte Priming our Mascara. We have the Urban Decay Eyeshadow Primer Potion. Uh, keep this out. I didn't use this. I forgot about it. You have to probably because it's small. Put it right there next to the Mac. We have our Real Her. This is a black eyeliner. I'm actually going to put this one back up. I have a little spot up by my lipstick where I keep all of my mini uh, eyeliners. So we have our Patrick Star One Size Concealer. We'll put that back up. No, nope, mascara can roll it back. We have our two single shadows this week. I used the trip, but I did not use this one both those back up. Lila B. This is supposed to be a cream cream blush for your cheeks or for your lip. Uh, it's a lip and cheek. I use it for my cheek. I love this. I will put in that back. I was really surprised at how well this, how nice this was. Our next glitter glue that always stays out. For those random palettes have glitter in them. We have the Huda Beauty. This is a Stick foundation. I have in the shade Toasted Coconut. Let's see. This is okay to use, but I've learned I got to go one section at a time on my face with this one. That's okay. 
not too bad. Because, I don't know, for some reason it doesn't spread out too well the longer it sits. So, that's the verdict on that. Not bad, but I will keep using it. Oh, we have the Hard Candy Fix-It Serum Hydration Skin. I think, I'm going to put this up. Yes. Yes, yes. We have the Becca Backlight Illuminating Primer. This is about four, this way through on it. It's not too bad. Sad I can't repurchase it now, though. Just because, you know, their brand is done, so that's okay. And then we have the Urban Decay All Nitro Setting Spray. So let's put all, we put most of our stuff back this week. A uh, small little touch up, you will notice there are some things missing out of our Project Pan. That is okay. Project Pan for me is to basically lose, use up some things I want to use up and to see if I like some products and if I don't like those, just discard them, you know? Okay, let's get our basket here. Gosh. Tis the season. And Merry Christmas, everybody. When you're seeing this, I'm filming this, I think, the night before. Okay, so primers. I want to pull out the Charlotte Tilbury Flawless Filter. I really like using this. So I'm going to pull this back out. Also, look. Ooh, I got a full size, so when I run out of that, I'm good to go. And I think... I think I want to use I'm gonna use the hydration primer I think with it. It's all over here. Or you know what? Let's try it with using the photo finish from Smashbox. So that's our two primers. I'm experimenting with mixing primers. Oh, wrong drawer. Foundation and concealer. Our found beautiful foundation drawer here. I'm thinking is that I, because I think after this week, I'm going to go and use some of my dropper foundations for a bit. Like, you know, things like this one and that one. But I think foundation, I think I'm really going to use this Dior one because I've been looking forward to it after I bought it. So, go ahead and throw that in our basket. I throw it over and set it in there. And I'm going to re-pull out this Milk Makeup Flex Concealer because I really like that. We're going to pull that back out to use again. Setting powders. I think we're going to use our Huda Beauty. Yes. Um, I did leave out a finishing powder, so we won't touch our finishing powders this week. Bronzer. I don't want to use a cream bronzer. So I think, oh, let's use our BoxyCharm one that we got, our Visar one that we just bought. Art. Blush. Um, oh, look at that. Look at all that room for blush I have. I don't think I'm going to use one of these blushes this week. I think I'm going to go pick out a blush palette. Maybe. Oh, decisions. But the Natasha Denona one I can use. Haven't used that in a minute. You know. Let's go use a blush palette. We're doing it. We're using a blush palette. Let me back it up. Okay. That's highlighters. Mm. Highlight. Let's go ahead and use this Becca Own Your Light highlighter. Let's see if I can get it open so I can show you guys. That is the Becca Own Your Light highlight. Pull that one out. Blush palettes. 
Mm hmm. Glad you can be. We have a melt one. We were just using this a couple weeks ago, I think. We have that one. So we have a couple. So we can use, you know what? Let's use this one. We use the Rogue Romance. This is in, this is the, it just says Rogue Romance. Okay. I'm going to use the Rogue Romance blush palette. That's just oranges and red. I'm going to use this one. Setting spray. Okay, so it's I kind of have, I think I put out like a lot of newer stuff. I don't know. Do I use the Elf Dewy Coconut Setting Mist? I have the Patrick Ta here. Could go to this beautiful Holy Mist one. So many options. I think I'm gonna go with uh. Patrick Ta for now. We use our Patrick Ta for this week. Okay, move that over so I can access this drawer. I left out an eye primer that I forgot to use from last week. Mascara. I use a Melt Supernatural Mascara. And I don't need a mascara primer. Don't need a brow pencil. Which one is this one then? Oh, this Makeup by Mario one. This one's pretty cool. You just push the brow up. It's pretty cool. Pull that out one next week, I think. And single shadows. I do want to get... What do I want to pull out here? Mm. Let's pull out this Tinkerbell one in the shade Straight Until Morning Super Sock. And then I think I'm going to pull out. Oh. No, don't pull it out like that. But I think I'm going to pull out these little cake liners. I think they still have life to them. Yeah. I'm going to use these cake liners this week. Or do I want to use... Um, we'll use these three right here. Okay. Well, this is my current for my Shop My Stash items this coming week. Tell me, what did you pick up? Did you pick up anything? Are you using, going to use the same ones from last week into this week? Let me know. Thanks for watching. See you in my next one. Bye.